Hey guys, it's Phil from Cleveland Moto. I've got a brand new color of Vespa for you. We literally just uncrated this bike today. You won't get it any fresher. I mean, less than five minutes ago, we were out in the parking lot taking this bike out. This is the brand new Vespa GTS 300 in a fun new color called Arancino Impulsivo. Okay, so this is Impulsive Orange. And if you're familiar with the Vespa lineup of the old days, this is a color that is very much like that 1972 Vespa Rally 180. It's orange, but it's kind of getting into that red spectrum. What I've done for you today is I've lined up a whole spread of different versions of orange and red to give you an idea of how this bike looks in comparison to some other Vespas and some other products you're familiar with. We've added a bunch of white light in here to bring the colors and keep them as neutral as possible. So on my far left, you're right. That's the vintage red. You guys might remember that from 2007. And that's a color I like to call 1974 Rally 200 Burgundy, right? Or Burgundy P200 Burgundy. Uh, that's vintage red. They sold that bike for a very short while in 2007. And that is a Burgundy color. This is the Rosso Passione. The Rosso Passione, or what some people used to call Dragon Red or Vespa Red. This is the color that they've had since the ET4s. Very little change in the shading on this bike for a very, very long time. And then we've got the new guy. So then again, this is that impulsive orange. Now we have last year's 2020 Rosso Vignola, or what I would call Burgundy. Now that color is a little lighter than the old vintage red and it does have a lot of metallic in it so tons of metallic in that paint and then at the very far end your left my right that's the tangerine that you're used to seeing on those genuine buddies that happens to be a buddy kick 125 so, sort of a safety barrel orange if you remember that Vespa S150 with the square headlight from a few years ago that was more of that shade of orange so we say orange, it means a lot of different things to a lot of different people. And this does not have metallic in it. This is a non-metallic paint. It's very much a traditional old school color. It does come with this very, very deep dark chocolate brown saddle with the pebble grain to it. It's really nice. I do like that. It was a good choice for this bike. Now, if you're a Spangles fan or a Browns fan, you're going to be thrilled because the brown and orange look great together. It's going to be exactly what you're looking for in Team Spirit bikes. But I really wanted to call attention to the difference between the Rosso Passione and the Arancio Impulsivo. So that Arancio Impulsivo, this color, this is it. They're doing this in the 300cc version you have right in front of you here, and they're also doing it in the Primavera, which is the 150 and the Baby 50, the 50cc as well. So Keep in mind, that's the color. When you are looking at it, I know I've seen it in the websites, I've seen it in videos, I've seen it in all kinds of images, and the color isn't represented very well at all. Hopefully what we've given you guys today is a real good example or a suggestion of where that color is on that red spectrum so you can make a decision and see if that's the right color for you. Now remember the Vespas are coming in very slowly this year. So we're just now starting to get them into the dealership right now. So if you have a bike on pre-order, please be patient. They're on their way, coming in as just as quickly as we can get them. Remember to get in touch with us if you have any questions. It's phil at clevelandmoto.com. That's pretty easy to remember. I'm Phil. I will help you with anything you need. Go to our website, www.clevelandmoto.com, and please remember to ride fast and take chances. Oh.